If you have children in the room who are fans of Elmo, you might want to usher them out of the room for this next story. It's about the man who is the voice behind Elmo. His name is Kevin Clash, and he officially resigned from Sesame Street today after a second allegation of sexual abuse was made against him. It has rocked the world of Sesame Street, as Eric Sorensen reports. Hi, this is Kevin Clash from Sesame Street. It's strange that we should care. Kevin Clash isn't that famous. But his voice is. Elmo's happy now. Come on in, everybody! Among the wildly popular menagerie of Sesame Street Muppets, Elmo is the most beloved. That's for you, Mrs. Obama. Okay, Elmo. That makes the news of Kevin Clash, Elmo's alter ego, all the more sad. An accusation last week that the puppeteer had sex with a minor might have blown over. But when a second young man came forward, accusing Clash of having sex with him when he was 15, the Emmy Award winner resigned. The Sesame Workshop stated, The controversy surrounding Kevin's personal life has become a distraction that none of us wants. This is a sad day for Sesame Street. Hey! Clash started making puppets as a kid. He knew he wanted to join Sesame Street. When I was nine years old, it was just a dream that I had. Wow, I wish that I could work with the Muppets. Yeah, yeah. Clash created Elmo's personality and produced that childlike voice for 28 years. This is the song, la 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 la, Elmo's song. Everything Elmo did was cute. And among the most popular of all children's gifts was the Tickle Me Elmo doll. Elmo is the franchise. I've had parents tell me that mommy or daddy was not the first word their child said. Elmo was the first word their child said. Come on, Elmo, don't you want to play? Clash imbued Elmo with something that reached not just children, but across the spectrum of pop culture. Puppets work best when they seem real and the people behind them are forgotten. Maybe that'll still work for Elmo. Uh -huh. Eric Sorensen, Global News, Washington.